Okay. Here we go. So we already found the artifact here. Yeah? Which is good, but we can go further down. I'm a little bit wary of doing that, but uh, I'm going to be... I'm going to try to be careful here. Yeah? We got we get the odd Scorpiox, and we can basically deal with as long as we don't have too many... You know, as long as we don't have any terrible enemy combinations, we should be fine. Yeah, the poison is pretty strong. It's short, but strong. Okay, I need to shoot you. Dismember. Okay. Alright, yeah? That takes... you really take some damage from that. Now I know why I remember Scorpiox being kind of... Maybe a little bit trouble, a little bit troublesome, but, uh, yeah. We, uh, yeah, we're not. You know, and there's a turret, that's good. Okay, that gives us a bunch of slugs. We should be, we should be okay. turrets and more drowsy urchins okay we fell asleep obviously okay thing is that's actually kind of a deadly combination because if you fall asleep the turret is not gonna fall asleep it cannot fall asleep so we're just gonna get murderized by the turret Fungi cyclonate, okay. What do we have here? A sitting Arconaut. <laughs> what did we. <laughs> yeah, that guy is just sitting there, you know? And we. just go there, chop their arm off. Good. That's a shitty thing to do. And there's a trash monk. Steel mace. Carbide hammer. Yeah, not really the, the stuff I would want. But, oh well. Just need to find... You know what, we're just going to pick up the revolvers. They're pretty decent. We just need, to, need an axe. Just an axe. Let's see. I mean, I could use the fix it, but it's just a steel axe, you know? It's not. I feel like that's a bad use of fix it spray foam. Is there another stairs down? Yes, there is. Uh, let's go. Maybe one further, since we've already. Need a hand getting up. <laughs> um, since we've already... Oh, a gel weep. That's nice. We're going to collect... Oh, it's a fungus area, obviously. But we can collect a little bit of gel. So, what we're going to do... We have a rusted weird artifact, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to consolidate some of these water skins. And pour it into another container. Pull up into another container. And 
we're going to yeah it's just five drams of gel that we can get from here that is fine we're good and uh since this is a fungus area we have a natural stopping point here since we've already done the thing that we wanted to do we are good that's the first historic site done got an artifact got some credits which is good which means you know let's just do some uh basic oh there's a snap job boss i'm just going to do some over not overland travel some uh you know some canyon roaming oh it's a kindle thumbed guy disliked by flowers hated by trolls you need the gel for uh for some remedies for example I don't remember which one it was. I think it's the fungus remedy. I think you always need gel for the fungus remedy. Or at least there's a good chance you need gel for that. Okay, we have a rusted weird artifact. It's an explosive grenade. Let's just drop that. We're not going to repair it. Oh, implant stabilizer arm locks. That's actually pretty neat. We can actually put that in. We should put that in once we... Once we get there. I mean, it depends on what what other cybernetics we find at the Rusted Archway. But uh, a secluded pig farm. Neat. Okay. Um, but yeah, that's what the, what the gel is for. So, you kind of... If you, if you can get your hand on some gel... That's what you need. You also get gel when you desalinate uh, slime, I think. And uh, usually it's not easy to come by, so when you find some, just pick some of it up. Is that a... no, it's a star apple farm. We can just harvest them. They won't mind. Us harvesting their precious star apples. Do you have anything interesting? Jewel encrusted feathered sandals. Mm. Yeah, no. Okay. There's still hostiles. So let's get rid of all the snap jaws here. of a mind to just use the fix it but eh, the folded carbide two-handed thing is kind of all right it still bugs me that we can't really use what we what we're good at you know we do have the axe skills so it's actually kind of fine <clears throat> Okay, should we go for pistol? You know what? We're gonna use pistols. Oh, eh, it's, it's, a, it's a bad idea. Let's not do that just yet. It's actually a bad idea to... You don't need to specialize in ranged weapons at this point. Also, I'm only using one Borderlands revolver. What gives? Okay. Let's just keep going. You know, sometimes it, it can make sense to just... Uh, even though, like, the these Desert Canyon maps are not too interesting. But, you know... Sometimes you find, like... Sometimes you just have to... Have to search a few maps. You know, for, for example, Dromad Caravans or... You know, sometimes you can get this here. These... Equimaxes. But we're actually pretty good at fighting. You know, for some good experience. Right, so right now... I'm saving up my points, I forgot about that. 
I am actually saving up my points for ambidexterity, so... There's more Acromaxes here. I'll kill them. And uh, attract the ire of a lot of these. Dragonfly things. I'm just going to shoot them all out of the sky. Okay, 240. Need one more level up to get it. And yes, unicorn farming. That's what I do. We're also hungry, so... Well, let us make camp. Preserve all the star apples and stuff. Choosing greens to cook with. Yeah, let's do that. There's some Scorpio jerky. Mmm, tasty. Um, and we have not butchered all that much, interestingly enough. You eat the meal. Regen regeneration. Oh, that's kind of neat. That's kind of what I want. Regeneration, thirst at half rate, 11 max HP. Yeah, that's good. So now we have actually two usable recipes. How good. Tunic Iron Longsword, okay. Beat a bracelet, nice. Another cap, Iron Dagger, oh. Hello, irritable tortoise that we dismembered. Ruthlessly. Yeah, let's get that pump, pump shotgun, pump shotgun. Snapjaw Fort. Hmm. Maybe we're actually able to find an axe here. Sometimes you find... I think you can find a little higher tier weapons from these than just uh, in a supportable beehive. Uh, you know what? We're gonna get that. We don't have anything floating nearby, so... Yeah. Now we have the bees floating nearby. And we can collect honey. That's cool. I <laughs> also always like the the mental image. Yeah, we're just walking around with a beehive on our back. Because that's what we do. I would love if you could use the bees to attack enemies, you know, just sick them after them. But uh, that would be a neat mod. <laughs> Just use them as projectiles, essentially. Scaled leather apron. That was a weird artifact. Grenade? No, spring-loaded leather moccasins. That's actually kind of neat. Right. We already we just have normal leather moccasins, so we're gonna use those. And they are plus six move speed. Good. Table and a chest. Stun gas grenade, bent metal sheet, uh, nothing interesting. Oh, Steel Vine Reaper, there we go. Okay, so we're gonna equip that. You know, we're kind of downgrading from uh, Folded Carbide to Steel here. But... It's okay. It's okay. For now. We're going to find better stuff. You know, sometimes you can actually find good stuff in these snapdraw forts. Alas, not for now. Let's go back down. Apple hold. Hey, well, actually discovering quite a few settlements here. Yeah, let's get some more star apple. Star apple jam. Hello, that's an apple farm's daughter. Let's not look at her, because that's dangerous in this game. <laughs> they have a cellar. This is probably just underground, isn't it? Rusty subterranean desert canyon. Yeah, don't feel like that. Okay. Shale, shale, no shale. There's no shale in that. 
For some reason, the dog was aggressive to me, towards me. Do dogs not like me? Well, apparently dogs don't like me. Well, maybe I did something that got me in bad with dogs. Not a dog friend. Also, yeah, the dragonflies are also immediately hostile. Interesting. Huh. That makes this a little more annoying, because I always have to fight them. I mean, I don't have to, but I always got these things swarming around me. Making everything a hassle. At least there's some glow crows around. Let me take some of the heat off. Okay. Yeah, that w those are not the most interesting desert canyon runs here. We have another Aquamax, another horse map. And since the dragonflies are already hostile, I don't give a fuck. So, I'm just going to murder them. Freeze grenade! Yeah, sure. Let's get the freeze grenade. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's a bunch of them. Let's just shoot the dragonflies. Oops. He chopped off the right forefoot. Facing things doesn't count as looking. Yeah. <laughs> Can't straight, right? Like, you only fall in love when, once you, like, examine them. Which is, I guess, already kind of weird, isn't it? So, yeah. How many slugs do we have? 98. Okay, it's fine. I just need a few more turrets. Or maybe get to grid gate. And then we're, we are stacked with lead slugs. That should be fine. And these are no neutral. Interesting. Huh. Almost just hostile territory over there. Hey, don't crack my stuff. Little snap jaw. Don't appreciate that. Oh, that's a boss. Um, hated by the Gersh, hated by the villagers of Shur. Okay. To dismember you. Oopsie daisy. Let's be a bit more careful here. There we go. Gersh went up. But it of sure went up. I mean, why not? So what do we have here? Jewel encrusted bronze dagger. Oh, I'm gonna keep, keep that. Get the copper nuggets. And let's go over here and rest a bit. Okay. If young Ivy existed, I'd never look up from the ground either. Yes! Indeed, that is, uh... That is definitely true. You know, just... Periodically, you just get your foot impaled. Entirely. It's not... I would... I would not walk outside. Three corner jacks? What's a three corner jack? I'm afraid I'm not familiar with that. Yeah, that's what I thought. Tricorn hat. MX Australis, okay. 
I mean, it sounds like a tricorn hat, like a, like such a like a pirate hat, right? Like a pirate captain's hat. <laughs> These are probably plants that murder your feet in some way. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry, but uh, Streamlabs has automatically removed messages. I don't know. I think that probably triggered a word filter. I'm I'm pretty sure you weren't doing anything uh, <laughs> anything bad. I don't know. Something has triggered the Streamlabs word filter. Waves? No, it's not. MX Australis? That's weird. 11 messages were deleted. Okay, I need to... Good, good to see. I need to actually take a look at what my thing does. Because... Like, those were 11 messages? That was definitely a false positive. I've not seen, you know? I've not seen you doing any... Writing anything bad. At least I... I would not be expecting that. MX Australis. That is strange. Yeah, I'm, I'm so sorry that happened. I began using the Streamlabs stuff pretty recently to have chat show up on, on the screen. Ah, okay. Um, and I don't really have that much experience with it yet. <laughs> So... Whoops. I'm taking some damage here. So I might have, you know, I need to check that out. I need to... That was certainly a false positive. Hey, I'm actually getting in a bit of trouble here for my... For my horse farming. I'm just going to use a salve real fast. Probably do it without it, but... Not taking any risks here. Okay. Okay. PR. Prickle. <laughs> okay. I mean, the, uh, that's weird. Alright. That's definitely not a word I... Maybe the word prick? Maybe it doesn't want you insulting people with the word prick? I don't know why that is. Okay. Like, I don't consider that word too bad, I guess. Maybe I'm missing some cultural context there, but uh, as a non-native speaker. But, okay. All right, well, now we know. That contain other bad, yeah, but it's not that bad a word, right? Yeah. I mean, Okay, well, uh, I'm going to take a look. I'm going to take a look at the word filter, so... Yeah. Oops, no. Uh, it's a pig farm. We cannot continue because of that. Yeah, let's just go to the rusted artway. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to... Yeah, I, I'm sorry for the message deletion. At least you only... You were only timed out for one second, which is very not useful, I guess, if you were actually... If you were actually being bad. <laughs> Seeds that have big spines on them. Straight through a weak show and pale your food. Oh dear, that sounds... Ugh. I'm... I think I'm not a fan of that. And the race isn't blocked, yeah. I think that's actually uh, that's actually what I did. Like I uh, I have I have I've done like a, a a word filter myself with some of the really bad words in it. You know the really bad words. But uh, there's apparently another word filter as well. Maybe I need to turn that off. I don't know. 
I don't know. Yeah, don't talk about terrible plants in my chat. <laughs> it will get you banned, or at least timed out for one whole second. That will teach you. Okay. Um, cook from a recipe. Let's just... Sample the vine wafer sheave. Boar jerky. Oh, why not? Let's just do that. Cook. That's a good recipe. Hmm. Also, we have a laborer security card, so we can enter red doors, which is not that useful, but it is at least something. The pricklers are friendly, interestingly enough. So, for some reason, I got in good with them. There's a door that we cannot... Yeah, there's a room that we cannot enter. I hope the chest is not there. Okay, that's the stairs. That's good. The chest might be there. You know, there's a room with scrap and chests. At the rusted archway. I think it might be there. We might be able to cleave through the door. But... Probably not. Critical hit. Does it take damage? It does take damage. Yeah, well. We have a pickaxe. Right. Right, I forgot about that. Um, where is it? Tools. Pickaxe. Does that work now? Or maybe not the door, right? This. Oh, yeah. Full crease. That's just a scrap room. Yeah, let's just fill up our fucking inventory. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I don't need to have all this scrap. Okay. Well, at least... At least... At least. Okay, let me see. That is way too much scrap. I don't need that. Um, What should I do with it? <laughs> I mean, I could get disassemble, but that's not, that would not be a good thing. Oh, whatever. We're just going to drop it, probably. Don't think we're going to tinker all that much. Oh, and there's some stuff going on here. Mechanimus Corala. Mechanimus Koala. Okay, there's Mechanimus folks here. That means there's a boss, right. They have good stuff. I would love to murder them. I would enjoy to kill them. Maybe they can get themselves killed at the hands of other stuff here. The problem is, I think I would be in trouble with those folks. I think I cannot take on the... I think I cannot take on the whole group, unfortunately. Has anybody seen me doing this? No, yeah. Of obviously they have seen me doing this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here. I'm going to go up. And try to fight them on the stairs. Anybody coming up? No? Okay. Hello. Come here, buddy. Oh, shit. The oh, for dangles, yeah, that's not... This could be trouble. Well, now I gone and did it. Um, and there's all this slime here. Which does not make it any easier. Okay. 
There's a lot of dead stuff. No, they are not hostile anymore. Weirdly enough. Okay. Now you. The boss kill themselves. That could be possible. Sharp two-handed folded carbide longsword. We're just going to pick it up. We're not going to use it, but we already have, have a carbide dagger, so that's okay. I think the boss is still around, though. Yeah, they are. Okay, you get over here. Get out of the ice. Dismember. Flurry. And keep attacking. Okay, Mechanimus went down. Whatever. It's fine. We're just murdering. Canticles Chromaic. Okay. So, uh, weird artifact. That's a flamethrower. Good thing they weren't using it. Sphinx Salt Injector. Eater's Nectar. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Again, one attribute point. Uh, uh, that is applied immediately. That's more scrap. F salve Injectors. Hulk Honey Injector. Silver Nugget. Copper Nugget. Okay. Flamethrower could be useful for Golgotha. You know, let's pick it up. I'm probably gonna get rid of the scrap it's pretty soon. Okay. There's still the folded carbide axe. Somebody had a folded carbide axe. I wanna find it. Go to the stem. Folded Carbide Battle Axe. There we go. Metamorphic Polygel. Wow. We collecting. We are collecting. Ha! That was good. That was a good one. Oh shit. There's more stuff going on. Oh yeah, you. It's you. Slimy Mechanimus Corana. Sorry, buddy, but... I'm not gonna let you do this. <laughs> yeah, that was useful. That was useful. Um, no short... Oh, folded carbide short sword. Indeed. Alright. We equipped. That was a good fight. Now, like the... Let's see how the mechanists are doing. Factions. Cannabis. Minus 200. Okay. We are still... We are still in the neutral zone. So... Yeah. We're still fine. Yeah, I feel pretty good about that. About having murdered these... Innocent folks. But, uh, yeah. That was a good one. Do we have anything? I'm not really... I'm not really a fan of our armor situation, though. I'm kind of worried about that. Also, we are at our limit with scrap. We have 120 pounds of scrap. That's not... Okay, we're going to drop a bit of crap here. Let's drop the steel stuff. Let's keep, yeah, let's keep these, let's keep that. You know what? Uh, well, 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 let's keep the rest. And I'm, go I'm just going to drop the... You're not a fan of, sp of paper straws? Okay. Oops, no, I have equipped them, which was probably a bad idea. We don't need that much scrap here. Let's draw ten of these. Drop six of these. Drop eight of these. I think that's enough for now. Paper straws suck. <laughs> often they often don't, yes.
Good that we we've gone into the into the deep philosophical questions now. A lot of locked doors. Question is, where's the stairs? Oh, it's just over here. Okay. Here in the pool of slime. Yeah, there was like a whole hubbub about plastic straws, right? It wasn't really... We are the same thing, but with plastic bags. And, you know, I've never really used plastic bags, so it doesn't affect me, and it's probably better that we don't use them. But the, the stupid thing is, now supermarkets don't have plastic bags anymore, but all the vegetables and so on are wrapped in plastic, you know? So we're really doing the environment a solid here. No ethical consumption under capitalism and stuff. Yeah, I could get behind that. Well, there's a chain gun turret, you need to be a bit careful about that. And a beetle. Hmm. And I was killed by the chain gun turret. Okay. Yeah, right. I I kind of forgot that I'm just dodge value. And if you do dodge value, chain gun turrets are going to murder you because there are so many bullets. Well, that's that. That's fine, actually. That is okay. Um, that was a stupid death. That was a mis uh, miscalculation on my on my brain. On my brain side. Didn't think about. That's why I usually don't use dodge value. Um, I think I'm going to... You know what? I'm going to play the same character again. <laughs> I'm boring like that. Uh, we're going to... Because I want to make this work. I want to pl take this character to the, to the late game. Um, but the thing that we're, we're going to do differently right now... Yeah, most deaths are actually just laziness. This was just a... I just totally forgot about... You know, totally didn't think about that being a deadly combination. But we're going to go all in on armor now with this character. We're just going to put everything into armor. I've made uh, better experiences with that. And there's actually no reason why this character should be super fast. So, um... Even from a role-playing standpoint, it makes sense. So, yeah. Uh, what is what is my name? Um, whatever. Can't think of anything right now. Okay. Uh, so I think I'm just going to. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff I have to do today. Um. I'm just going to get past the starting stuff and then we're gonna call it a day probably yeah the classic Chang'an turret behind the door you know that, that was just a, a good amount of bad calls you know I also went for the musket turret for some reason which you know, like I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been able to destroy the chain gun turret anyways. But uh, yeah. Okay, so let's slug. Anything good? Glowsphere, we don't need that. Oh, the carbide dagger, I do want that. Let's see. We are starting out with some stuff. We are starting out with a grid gate recoiler. Wow. Get rid of all of that. The torches. Well, let's get rid of these. 
chem cell and combustion cell. Mm hmm, that's neat. So, we're gonna get the slugs and the carbide dagger. Might do some random runs sometime this week. Oh, that's cool. I would watch that. Maybe as an archive, but... Uh... Oh, we have an electrified steel hand axe. With no cell, no. But, you know, I can put in a chem cell. Oops. Wow. No, it's raining. Oh, let's remove the cell for now. We don't really need to use it right now. But carbide dagger. Uh, do we have anything else? A thermal grenade. Otherwise, we really have nothing. Do you have anything in terms of armor? Oh, we could get a... No, I'm going to get myself a suit of leather armor. For now. Instead of the wooden tunic. Oh, I already had leather armor. Hey. I'm good. I'm really great. It's just, sometimes I just have to say how good I am at this game. Okay. Steel potter's knife. Can get rid of this. Okay. Friday or Saturday? So many games to play at the moment. Yeah. I also have a few things on my... On my on my list. So I'm probably going to do another stream on Saturday. I usually want to do them on Friday, but on Friday I'm probably going to go to a festival because, you know, I need to get out and do some stuff and just allow myself to have a good time again. Which has been tough recently, but um, thank you. So I'm probably going to do that on f on Friday, but on Saturday I am planning to do a stream of Sigil, which is the new John Romero Doomwad. And that's essentially a full episode of like a fifth episode of the Ultimate Doom. Wow. Now it's actually what's it called? Like Slate? Or Hail? The weather just went from sunny and nice to ap apocalyptic in a very... in like five minutes. That is something. Okay. Um, but yeah, I, I do want to play Sigil. Sleet? I don't know. Slate is something else, right? I, uh... <laughs> I'm not up on my specialized vocabulary. Okay, so the historic site is south this time. That's cool. And uh, slate is a stone. Yeah, right. That's slate. Yeah, slate, I guess. Or like, you know, when ice comes from the sky, that's what I mean. <laughs> you know, it's not really a word, an English word that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. Um... Yeah, right, Slate Frog, right? Hail, yes. So, I think that's what I said. That was the second guess that I did, so... Okay, good. Hailstorm. The German word is Hagel, by the way. Okay, travel to Red Rock indeed. Good thing I haven't banned hail. You know, that's also part of some very unfortunate expressions. So you would also have gotten that one second timeout. Wow, it is loud. I think I have a window open somewhere. Um, okay, I think I'm just going to take that. I'm just going to take that opportunity to end the stream for today. So thank you. Yeah, indeed it is. But, you know, sometimes folks use that. Yeah, no, it's it's with an E, 
but you know it kind of means the same thing you can say hail something and it kind of means that as well with an a so it's just hail as a verb is just the translation of the literal translation of the word that we use or that we don't use actually do not use that word oh dear no oh, there's some thundering okay all right let's not let's not talk about these expressions and let's not use them definitely not because it's bad and it means you are a chump and deserve to be punched so and all of you are not so that's good that is uh Oh god, I'm just rambling bullshit. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to end the stream here. I need to check why this is so loud, because it means I have a window open, and I should probably not have a window open right now. So, um, thanks you all for watching. Thanks you all for hanging out in the chat. And have a good week. We're going to see each other again. Definitely next Tuesday for... The Caves of Cud stream, maybe on Saturday for some sigil, for some doom goodness. I don't know. We're gonna see. Bye bye. Will do. Bamba Boozler. Will do.